Hello, this is Norwich Up, and welcome to a Ultimate Team Squad Builder. So, you guys, I've got a 4 4 1 1 budget Netherlands team. This team was built around one player, and that player is Ricky van Volswinkel. But this is his transferred card that came out today. He's got 74 pace, 73 shooting, 72 dribbling, and 73 heading. 6 foot 1, 950 coins, so very, very cheap. 10 goals in 7 games is amazing as well. He's a great player. I'm going to give you my full thoughts on him in a review, which is going to be out tomorrow, which is Wednesday. It'll be out at 7 p.m., so make sure you check uh, my channel out at 7 p.m. for my full review on him. I built a squad around him, which is uh, really, really fun to play with, and I thought I'd basically share it with you guys. So let's get into it. So let's start this squad builder with the goalkeeper. And in goal, we have got a player called Martin Stecklenburg. He plays for Roma in the Syria. Got some good stats, 86 diving being the best at six foot six, so he's very very tall, and he only cost me 900 coins. Very very good player, good at reflexes and diving, not bad positioning as well, and decent kicking. Overall, a very very solid keeper. The two centre backs we go on to now, we have firstly got Johnning Heitinger. He plays for Everton. He's got 74 pace, 74 passing, 79 defending, and 77 heading. He's not a bad player. Sometimes he does get muscled off the ball um, because he's only 5 of 11. He's not the tallest of centre backs, but overall, he's a pretty good centre back. With his partner, we have got Buller Roos. He plays for Sporting. He's got 68 pace, 75 defending, and 74 heading. And he's 6 foot, so he's a little bit taller than Heitinger. He's uh, got Decent stats, so not amazing pace, but pretty good defending and hitting stats for a non-rare gold. And overall, a pretty good uh, centre-back. Now we're going to the right-back, and that's going to be a PSG player, and that is Gregory van der Beel. He's got 85 pace, 72 passing, and not bad driven defending and heading stats as well. Got a high attack and work rate, medium defensive work rate, not too bad for a right back. 800 coins is a very, very cheap price, and overall, I didn't mind him too much in the game. Left-back we go on to is a silver player. And that is Willems, I think is how I say his name. He's got a four star weak foot, three star skill moves, 700 coins, so he's very, very cheap. 80 pace, which is very, very nice to have. And he's got good defending and heading, dribbling and passing stats as well. So he's a pretty good player. Then we're going to the left midfielder, and that's going to be a five star skiller. And that is El Horo Elia. I probably said that completely wrong. Um, but he's got 91 pace, which is very, very nice to have. 85 dribbling. 70 passing and 68 shooting. Got a very, very nice finesse shot on him. Uh, 950 coins. One goal in seven games. Not amazing, but overall, he's a very, very nice player. The right midfielder is going to be the most expensive player on the team. That's the silver. That's a four-star skill, a four-star weak foot player called Jody Lukaki or Lukaki or something like that. I'll probably completely say his name wrong again. I do uh, struggle with these names probably, but he cost me 3,200 coins. 93 pace, 73 chilling. As I said, four size gummies, which is nice to have. He used to play in the right wing position. That's his normal uh, position, so that's why he cost me a bit more. But overall, a nice player. You could go with, like, Lenz or um, someone else. Uh, but overall, Lukaku is a very, very nice player. The final uh, players of the team now, we go into, we've got Strutman and we've also got Fur. Fur is actually apparently linked to Norwich and Newcastle. So if he does go to Norwich, that would be amazing. He's very, very good, very, very strong. And he's uh, quite tall at 6 foot 2. Every set above 73, which is nice to have. 550 coins, 3 goals in 7 games. is quite good for a centre midfielder as well. And overall, a very, very solid player. Strutman, on the other hand, is not too bad. His team this season card looks um, a lot better than this normal card. He only has 62 pace, which isn't too good at all. Um, not amazing heading, but okay passing, dribbling and defending as well. Overall, a solid player. Then the centre forward is going to be the most uh, high rated player of this team. And that's going to be Klaas Jan Huntelaar. He's got 71 pace, 82 shooting, 71 dribbling and 79 heading. Not too bad stats there. Three goals in seven games, 850 coins. So very, very cheap player. And not bad. He's got good strength in game, a good shot. But his pace could be slightly improved if you guys really wanted to get a, an amazing centre forward player. Then the final player, we've already talked about him, Van Vorsvinkel, amazing player, have a review on him out tomorrow at 7pm. And now guys, as usual, let's get into the live commentary in Division 1 this time. Alright, so I'm back here, we're going to go and search for an opponent, see who we come up against Frank here, this is his team name, is he going to accept, let's see, there we go. So he's got a Liverpool kit, I've got my Norwich home kit of course, Norwich badge as well, I'm just Norwich everything basically, let's see his team, he's got his Syria team, Buffon, to Chegli, uh, no, not to Chegli, Crisito, that's it, Bozagli, Chiellini, Abate, De Rossi, Giovinco, Palacio, Schneider, Di Natale, and Mikkeli, nice team there, and uh, everyone in the right formation, and on good chemistry, so it's going to be a diff difficult game, and let's see what happens in this game, hopefully Ricky can get himself a few goals, which would be nice, and yeah, let's get into it, 
and I hope you guys enjoy the live commentary of this squad builder. Oof. Had an effort from there, probably was never going to beat Buffon, but had to go anyway. Go on, Ricky. Go on, Ricky. Yes, Ricky. Ricky Van Volsvingel, 35th minute. Bit lucky, I do uh, hate those goals where you throw it out and they head it straight back and you've got a, an open uh, run and it's unfortunate to concede them, but we are 1-0 up with Ricky Van Volsvingel against Frank there, 1-0 up and uh, really against play. <laughs> oh, what? What tackle, what a tackle. Buntela <laughs> gets ta Wait, Buffon's taken it. Oh my god, the keeper's just taken it. Go on, try and make him pay for this. Come on. Oh, come on, quickly. Smash. How does he get back in the net? Oh, what a kick. Oh, whoa, whoa. Ref! Ref! There we go. Penalty. Yes, as I thought. Just got the penalty there. Unlucky to him actually not to uh, clear that. But who's got the best penalties? Um, it seems like Ricky Van Vorsfinkel has got the best penalties at 92. Go in top left-hand corner. And we go in there. Right in the side netting. Nice penalty there from Ricky Van Vorsfinkel. Uh, the keeper's not going to save that, so 2-0 up and looking good. Nice ball in there, but Van der Veel... Whoa, 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 no! Oh, what the hell just happened? What the hell just happened? I had the ball and it suddenly changed player when I wanted to head it back. I don't even know what's happening. Ref. Oh, that's a beautiful finish. Unbelievable finish there from Klaasian Huntela. Such a good chip there. Um, the technique on that, uh, I don't know if like every player can do it, but that was a, a nice finish there. So 3-1 up now in the 69th minute. And looking like probably we can win this game. What a run from Fur. Go on, Fur. Foul. That's a red card, actually. Yeah, even though it wasn't a foul for a red card... But because he was the last man, I think it has to be a red card. Um, take a look at this again, guys. Do you think this is a red card? Leave a comment down below if you think that's a red card. Right. Come on. Come on. Boom. Oh, what a header. Fur. 90th minute. I wasn't expecting a header like that. That The power on that was great. So, guys, full time we win 4-1. It was a great game. Um, he did start off very, very well. Should have scored earlier on. He did get a goal uh, eventually, though. In the end, guys, a great game. Van Volsvinkel gets two. Hunsar gets one. And Fur gets one assists. One from Van Volsvinkel and one from Fur. Overall ratings, 9.3 for uh, Van Volsvinkel uh, and 9.4 for Fur. So, guys, thanks for watching this score build and live commentary. If you did enjoy it, make sure to leave a like rating down below. And if you've got this far, as again, make sure to leave a comment down below. Last time, guys, two people actually got this far. That means so much that you actually watched the whole, like, eight-minute video, which means uh, you guys obviously enjoy my content, which is nice to hear. So thanks for watching, guys. If you guys want me to do more scoreboards and any suggestions, leave a comment down below as well. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you guys next time. Tomorrow, have pro clubs.